So before we get started with the insulation, I want to make something very clear here um, about file structure. And I, I always have a, um, a video that I would actually have um, to install, uh, talk about file management with it. And I don't want to take too much time from this uh, from our class to talk about file management with it. I assume you know how to create file management for your classes and everything with it uh, up to this point because this is a programming class and I assume that you have some sort of uh, background in computers with it. But just FYI, um, I'd like for you to create a directory um, underneath document, anywhere in your local drive, I don't care. Um, call it, I don't, you know, you have to have a directory with, with a course number, which is this ARTV 2471 for me, all right? No spaces, just, you know, uppercase ARTV 2471. Inside of that, create a subdirectory. I want to drill down on this so you can see on my left hand side here. And this is what I like for you to keep this as. You're going to create uh, a directory called ARTV 24 or 2471 with a subdirectory called labs in here. And I, I gave you a file that um, it's a class exercise. You download this from eCampus with it. Once you download this file, uh, you extract it. Inside of that, you're going to have three zip files, compressed file, and you're going to right mouse click on each one of these and you're going to extract it all. All right, so unzip it, create a directory with this. Don't dump everything in, in the directory, in this directory. Keep three of these zip files, the ones with the vice in there, the compressed files. It says win zip file. These are the compressed files. So create a subdirectory, one, for example, um, uh, Android Studio, for example, right mouse click on it. Extract all, open with, and I have WinZip downloaded into this thing with it, or you can use Windows Explorer with it. But if you did this, and if you click on it, um, it takes you to this, and you click on Extract, okay? And it'll tell you where to extract this to. So I I have this thing, I have a, a folder. Uh, I created a folder called Gradle-7 underscore 2. And then it extracted in here, it created a folder, Grado 7.2. So do that for each one of the zip files that I gave you. Um, you're welcome to use this. I, I put everything in one place so you don't have to go to each of the um, uh, place and search for it. In the video parts of the installation, I show you where I got these files. All right. So it's up to you if you want to go and get it uh, and search like I did on the internet with it. Everything should be easy. I mean, the Android Studio is easy to get. The uh, JDK is easy to get. What's troubling is the Gradle. So in the Gradle, and you, you have to read and dig for it. I know how much you guys love reading with it. So I, I have a link inside of this. So you see where it says the Gradle.org uh, release with it. And if you go to this link right here, uh, it gives you all the versions that's out there with it. Okay. And here's how you want to look at this thing. So these these are all passed because you have different operating system different on different phones. We're going to use the latest one is the 7.2 um, right here. And you click on this this complete right here. Uh, that's where you will get this file. So if I click on com complete uh, 7.2, that's where I got the 7.2 is the zip file here. Let me show you down here. So I move that inside of your directory, and I come and I and I extract that. Uh, that's what that looks like. So that's where the link comes in with it. So this is con this concludes a little preamble of what we're about to install. Okay, so I have everything in there for you. Very well.